Something very strange is happening. Oh. Oh, God. Oh. One metre ninety, guys. Oh, my God. <laughs> that is the jump I fell at. At Bicton, we found it. Star Long. How does that make you feel? Brings back some bad memories. vlog. This week's vlog is a little bit different because it will not be myself riding. Scott and I are heading to Bicton Five Star, the first five star in the UK for two years. So it'll be the first time heading there back there after my fall. Scott and I are camping. Scott hates camping so I don't know how this is going to go but for some reason I managed to convince him see maybe how many fences are similar to the four star that Zeb did. I have had a little bit of a preview. I think there are quite a few jumps that Zeb did do even before we fell. Um, so that'll be quite cool to see, yeah, the sort of jumps that maybe we've done or we could do. And maybe we'll see if I will feel ready to do a five star at some point in the future. So we're gonna take you along to Bicton, so let's go. We have just stopped off at Little. Let me say something. We were meant to go in there to grab some camping supplies and food. Look what Ashley just panned down. Look what we've come out with. It's got crisps, sweets. They they are camping essentials. Yeah, and some fruit. We've got some healthy stuff in there. Okay, guys, we have made it to the campsite. It is a very, very nice and quiet campsite, actually. You walk so slow, I walk don't slowly you? and I'm carrying a bag. I think you've done very, very well. So this is going to be our spot here. We did used to go camping every year. I have done some camping in my time. <laughs> what, a seasoned camper, eh? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> right, Ash, people are not going to want to sit there and watch us put up a tent, so we're going to put up the tent the only way we know how. Count down from three and jump. You ready? Three, two, one. Whoa! <laughs> that was so well done. Fast. Well it, done. Actually, Scott, should we take a quick? Yeah, let's do. Hang on, let's do a bit. I'm going to do some B roll of the tent. Ready? <laughs> The automatic pump that plugs into the car wasn't working. So what have we here, Scott? Scott's getting sweaty. Fortunately, he didn't go to the gym this morning. <laughs> off to bed now. We're all snuggled up. In our... We are going to sign off now. See and we tomorrow. will see you in the morning. Hey guys, it is now Saturday morning. We are going to head on down to Bicton, walk the cross country course and watch the cross country action. Right, shall we head off to Bicton? Let's Real quick. head Three, off to Bicton. Two, one. Hey guys, we have made it to Bicton uh, Five Star. We are gonna head out and have a walk of the cross country course and see if any of the jumps are similar to the four star long I did with Zebedee. And they to look see a lot similar so far. They do. They? I think there'll be some added combinations, obviously, because it's five star, it's got to be more technical. Okay, so we are at the first fence of the five star, which actually I think is the same first fence as the four star. So I have done this, a really nice fence. I mean it's still big, don't get me wrong, but a nice fence to get you into the rhythm. That's all you care about. <laughs> <laughs> 
the way there and then you're going to come all the way back because you're either jumping. So the arena, the Clif Clifton, uh, Clinton, Devon Estates, fence 14. And we're really well over the skinny brush there. Make Ashley's head so big. <laughs> you might go on the channel. Yeah, you're going to go on the yeah. vlog. Yeah, we are vlogging. Is that okay? Today. On the vlog, we've got Hattie and we've got Harriet asking for us. Ashley asking for a signature. I know. I feel pretty famous now. <laughs> <laughs> Property and estate management. Quick. Something very strange is happening. We are getting recognised. <laughs> Not we, you are getting recognised no, by... it is we. Well, we were here for like not two minutes and we've had people come up to us. Yeah, we have had quite a few people, which is actually lovely. This since is the then. first event we've been to, for a big event basically, for a long time. And since we kind of really have got the YouTube going um, and we've had quite a few views and it is so lovely. So many people coming up saying hi, having chats with us, really, really enjoying it. I think Scott just thinks my head's getting bigger, but no, yeah. I'm actually really enjoying it. And please everyone, whenever you see us at an event come and say hi because we always want to say hi to you especially like events like this where I'm not competing you can stand and chat for ages <laughs> oh my god <laughs> that is spin round the jump I fell at at Bicton we found it star long. how does that make you feel brings back some bad memories <laughs> I mean it's big don't get me wrong it's very big but it's just a solid sort of table. But it was a little bit further down, so it was on more of a downhill. Way further down it there, down the hill. It was way further down there. It was put it here trees. this time. So it's on a bit of flatter ground. But yeah, it's not making me feel hugely great. All I remember is taking off, and then as I was landing, thinking this isn't going well, and then I woke up with all the uh, medical staff. <laughs> well, he easy made that, that look easy, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Why I fell at it, who knows? <laughs> okay, next up we have Izzy Taylor coming to the first water at Fence 5. Izzy Taylor, very, very experienced, so hopefully she should do this nicely. Over the black going to do it nicely Lovely. Lovely, lovely, lovely textbook. <laughs> We're now at fence 14, which is the drop down to the skinny. So we had that in the four star long. We just had the drop to the skinny, which is hard enough as it is. But now with the five star, they have also added in these rails. It is very, very steep. And then down to this really tough skinny, which they did exactly the same in the four star and put the tree there. You have got these rails here. Yep. Bounce to this bounce. huge ditch. Bounce over this C part. However, there is an alternative. I would do the alternative. <laughs> I did the alternative at the four star and I'd have no shade okay, in the alternative. Well, but let's see. We will watch this because yeah. I think this will be interesting. Mm -hmm. Let's see how she does. Nice. Very nice. Lovely, I could ride it like that. Because you're coming to this house, this, we'll try and get some footage from the other direction. It's got a huge, huge drop after it, tough enough as it is. And then you can kind of see, you go down the bank, turn right, and there's these two really narrow corners, 9A to B. Oh, wow, yeah. Yeah, this I think is going to cause Let's a go lot down of issues. Middle That's the first one we've watched, but I also heard Oliver Townend had to circle, so she just came down the That bank. was Pippa Funnel, right? That was Pippa Funnel. She then did, then did go the straight route and jumped it beautifully, but has wasted herself quite a lot of times. Oh. oh God. Louisa oh, Lockwood uh, did a good job of making the turn to the wow. first of those brushes uh, just, in the arena, yeah. but sadly has a run out at the second of the <laughs> corners, 9B. She now takes the long way. So she did a good job. She was trying to get him to lock on. He just hadn't locked on. And oh, still up there. Okay. It's a three-part combination of rails. I'm going to zoom in. And these are very wide. 
to these skinny white rails. Quite a forward four strides, I think, between the first two, three or four strides to the skinny. So you've got to kind of be riding positively to the first two because they're big and wide. Yeah. But then you've got quite a tough accuracy question with the skinny as the last element. So then you've got to really make sure you land over the last one and they know where they're going. You're straight and you're not too fast. <laughs> it was actually five and four heat, but I wonder whether it is. I'd like to watch another one just to see how they do it because he looked like he was holding a bit, but maybe not. Okay, guys, the cross country has finished. Uh, top three uh, in being interviewed in the live zone. So the top three are in third place, we have Gemma Tattersall. Second place, we have Pippa Funnel. And first place, we have Piggy March. So all top three are female riders. They don't have what, a bit even, of girl power. Yeah, girl power. They don't even have one pole between them. So tomorrow will be a very, very exciting day where they will show jump and determine who will win the only five star in the UK for two years. Right, the layout and the, the terrain of it, and really sort of taken quite back of the of how intense. Oh, it's a brilliant sport. It's a great sport, but I think the nerves and apprehension in the morning is always wanting to have a safe ride and very relieved that I managed to breathe and get to the finish on both horses. And you can go to badminton next year now, Pixie. After <laughs> 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 Pixie, we've come back. <laughs> the lilo <laughs> is fat. It's <laughs> <laughs> trying to blow up. <laughs> I hate camping. He hates camping. I hate, <laughs> I hate camping. Morning guys, it is now Sunday morning. I convinced Scott to go back to Bicton today. We originally weren't going to go for show jumping day and to see who wins. So I thought it would be quite a good end to the vlog for you guys to actually see who won. Yeah, get the tent down and head back to Bicton. Okay, we're here. We're at Bigton. The show jumping doesn't actually kick off until 1 p.m. So we're currently, they've had a couple of demos, but there is about to be a high jump demo with two young show jumpers, apparently. They look good though, don't they? They do look very good. They've had a little bit of a practice. Right, we will, um, yeah, we'll, we'll show you what's going on. Tiny! God, is this all we're at already? Measuring stick out. One meter 56. One meter sixty seven now, guys. Oh, big tick on! At one meter seventy three. And the crowd goes wild! Okay, this is one meter eighty. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Come on, Elliot. One meter ninety, guys. One meter ninety. Very, very, very impressive. Okay, we are sat here waiting for the show jumping to start. They run in reverse order, so we'll have to wait right to the end to see the top three and see who is going to come out on top. Let us know who you think is going to win in the comments below. Four Great Britain, Gemma Tassel and Chili Knight. And 
So last to go for Great Britain, uh, Piggy March and Veneer Kamira. We've all been there, eh, Ash? We've all been there, not at five to nine. <laughs> well, that was uh, two down there. Gemma Tattersall. <laughs> Second, Gemma <to> Funnel. <laughs> Third, Piggy March. <laughs> Piggy and his five star. <laughs> Cream or well, we haven't had a bar for a week, so that'll be helpful. That is the end of Bicton Five Star, the first five star in the UK for two years. Gemma Tassel won, Pippa Funnel second, third, Piggy March. Absolutely gutting for Piggy, but I think absolutely amazing for Gemma. I think for me, it's been really nice coming to a five star and actually looking at it and thinking that is all jumpable and I definitely would love to do it one day. It's really made me realize that that is definitely something I really do want to do. So I hope you have enjoyed this vlog. If you did and you saw us, like, thank you so much. I loved meeting all of you guys. It was amazing. That was definitely a highlight of the weekend. So yeah, I hope you've enjoyed this vlog. Thank you so much everyone for all your support, uh, your comments, your views, your likes. Really, really appreciate it. And we will see you for the next one.